Frazier here, and I want to talk about the... I've been studying the law of attraction, faith, science, reticular activating system, you know, just things like this for a while now. And I don't really know what my true beliefs on it are, but I do know when certain things happen um, that I try to learn things from. And what I mean by that is, and it's a simple basic example, but... I was in the, my car fumbling around with some stuff about to go into school and I, I hadn't ate lunch and so I was looking for change. I like to, you know, uh, go to the vending machine sometimes. Basically, I needed a quarter or actually I needed 20 cents and I'm fumbling around my bag. You know, I needed 20 cents to buy, you know, 20 more cents to get whatever, you know, candy bar or whatever it was. And I have a pen in my hand and got my car keys I got my 80 cents, you know, just fumbling around. Uh, I didn't have any dollar single ones at the time. And I was almost late for class, so I'm kind of fumbling around at the last second. Man, I need 20 cents. I dropped my pen, and it was kind of annoying. But the funny thing was, when I got out of the car to go pick up my pen, there was a nice shiny quarter on the floor of the back seat. And it's actually been sitting there for, you know, past two weeks. I remember seeing it. But that was uh, my instant manifestation, if you will, of my 20 cents that I needed for the vending machine. Taking something simple like that and applying it to life, uh, you can learn a few things. Well, a few things I took from it was dropping the pen. The annoying thing that happened actually led to the quarter. Same thing on a bigger, serious perspective, going through a divorce kind of propelled me on this path of personal development and study I would have probably never had pursued had I stayed married. And, you know, we could just learn different things that when things happen that on a surface annoy us or anger us or set us back, but that's the very same thing you need in order to get to that next level. Um, and so taking that on a much bigger perspective when things don't go right, just know that that is, in fact, the very thing that needs to happen to get you to actually go to where you want to go. Um, and so when things happen, just, just stay motivated, stay happy, stay inspired. And, you know, yeah, it sucks sometimes, but these little speed bumps are the very things necessary in order to get us to that next level. So something to think about. My name is Rob Fraser, and we'll see you in the next video.